I, tw- I tweeted this out last year. <clears throat> I think it was in March. So obviously you guys played some more games. But the point remains, um, your, the most li- used lineup, which was 37 games last year, was uh, DeAnthony uh, in the starting lineup. That lineup had a defensive rating of 112. Uh, the second most used lineup uh, with in 30 games uh, was you instead of DeAnthony. And that lineup had a 108.5 defensive rating. Um, which is interesting. I'm just saying. I'm not saying you're a better defender than DeAnthony. No, I love DeAnthony. No, I'm, I'm just saying it's just it's, interesting how a perception of a player, and then you look and you're like, oh, wait a minute, that team actually defends better with that player in the lineup. It's interesting. I'm just, I just look. My thing was, I didn't want any conflict, and like you said, I love DeAnthony too. So like we, if I'm be honest, with you, we like closest. Like me, I'm closer to Joe, but like me and Mel became like real close over the past two years. It's like I like. Just the other day, I'm calling him. We play video games together. He lives like 10 minutes away from me. We hang out. We eat. Like, So we, we're both like, okay, just let us know what we, y'all want us to do. Because like, we don't want it to be weird for us. It's funny we get a shoot around. And we're like, are you starting? Am I starting? <laughs> I'm like, I don't know yet. But here, you know what? Come in. Get get me. You know what I'm saying? Like, But it, it's cool, man. This it, is the NBA, folks. Yeah, this it's just how it goes. It's just how it goes. And it's like, I mean, it's for me... The reason why I was a little upset, my mental was a little off for a couple of games. I remember we played Boston, the Knicks, and I think San Antonio in this three-game stretch. And it's the less I've ever talked, like in shooting around and stuff in my career. I can admit that. You know what I'm saying? I was vulnerably upset. I, I would talk to my uncle, talk to my uh, my mom and dad. I was upset because I just felt like, man, I, I worked so hard for my spot. I worked so hard for this opportunity for, and I was playing so well for it to be kind of like taken away because of my foot is like, dang, this, this hurt. It hurt me, but I just wanted to keep pushing for my team. I wanted to keep getting better. The the last thing uh, in the original uh, answer you gave about 10 minutes ago, uh, I had three follow-ups. This is the third follow-up. Uh, you talked about the best version of yourself and being the best version of yourself. Uh, and I, I know you work hard because I've talked to people and they, they have confirmed that. Um, when you think about the best version of yourself in two years, the best version of yourself in five years, what does that look like? Because, and the reason I asked that, and, and again, you're getting ready to turn 23. I'm not the person that would ever put you in a box. Right, right, right. But there are people that like to compare players. Comparison is the thief of joy. I'm not trying to steal your joy here. The box would be the 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 Lou Williams, the Jordan Poole, the Tyler Hero, Pro, and the, those guys. By the way, those two of them, they're still figuring out who they are as players. So for you, what does the best version look like down the road? You know, I guess we, like you said, we're still figuring that out. Like so I'm still twenty, about to turn twenty three in a month, and for me, I just want to be able to say like, like bro, like. There was no, I don't have any what ifs about my game. Like I was able to check off all these boxes. Like, okay, people say I couldn't shoot coming in. Now I, you know, now I shoot a high percentage from three. Okay, boom. My next year was like, oh, he can't shoot off the bounce off pick and roll. Okay, now I can do that. Oh, he can't play me. Okay, now I can make these certain reads that I can. He can't defend. Last year in the playoffs, there was they, they, they couldn't. De- like, you know what I'm saying? There wasn't the situation where it was like, oh, we got to take you off the court because you're not defending well. You know what I'm saying? Every single. Critics, criticism that I take and everything, I take it to heart because I want to I want to play. I want to be out there on the court with my guys. I want to be, you know, in the mix of, of trying to help us win. And then individually, it's like, man, I just want to keep getting better every day. Like, I just want to, I'm not going to sit here and bring up goals and stuff like that or, or accolades, but like, I just want to be someone who is at the end of the day, one, I'm comfortable who, who I was as a player and myself. And two, I want people to say like, man, he was way better than what we gave him credit for. He was way better than what we thought he would be. You know what I'm saying? Like Lou Will is a great player, wonderful. Like he, like one of the people that I watch because I like, I like these little fadeaway stuff. Like, Lou Will was a motherfucker. Let's be clear. A, it, <laughs> Let's be clear. Long he career too. Probably, in my opinion, he could have started on a lot oh, yeah, of. T- you yeah, know yeah. what I'm saying? But yeah. for what y'all needed on the Clippers or what, you know wherever he was. Well, at. I didn't play with Lou. He came in after me. But true, yes, true, yeah, true. Yeah, yeah, but whatever yeah, yeah. what the Clippers needed, I had to guard his ass. Unfortunately, <laughs> yeah, that that wasn't fun. He was he was my matchup in the second round, my rookie year. And I was like, okay, well, why did like you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah. how do I get him from going left? He wants to go left every play. How do you stop from fouling him? Yeah, what are you talking about? <laughs> every time do... he drives left. Yeah. Isn't that pump? I'm like, bro, I'm 19 years old. I'm like, I'm thinking he's gonna shoot it. What do you mean? But like, 
Yeah, I just want to be the best version of myself. Like, I just want to get better every single day. I want to be able to, I want to knock on the door. Honestly, I want to knock on the door of those guys that are, you know, in the all-star game and those different things like that. So we'll see where that takes me.